This morning in the Roadshow Kitchen, owner Craig is here from the Breachway Grill. We're making one of my favorite things, fish tacos. Perfect for this time of year. And your place is great for this time of year, too. It is. We're, he we're heading right into our season now. Mm -hmm. And you said uh, some patio season. It's Patios, patio, uh, we're getting it up and running. On and, the way. Yep. So we're going to get some outdoor good weather, and we're going to be good to go. Yeah, especially for this weekend. It's all about tacos this all weekend. About tacos. Cinco de Mayo and fish tacos yes. are a great staple, especially here in Rhode Island with all the fresh fish that we have. So take us through the ingredients. Sure. We have uh, corn tortillas for the gluten-free mm. crowd, some fresh Atlantic cod. That's awesome. Um, some Old Bay seasoning, our flamingo slaw, slaw, which is marinated cabbage with jalapenos, mm. some white cabbage, some um, pico de gallo, and some mango salsa, and some fresh avocado. Yum. And I love love that um, pickled cabbage. Yeah. Over there. I, we were saying I like anything pickled. Pickled, pickled onions, pickles, uh, pickled cabbage too as well. And then what sort of uh, dressing do you have to go We on? have a little uh, coulee, which is sour cream, cilantro, and jalapeno. Mmm, that sounds like a nice balance, especially it balances with it off. great fresh ingredients. going to have a nice crunch to it as well. Is the fish fried or, or pan seared? It's pan seared. Yeah, so yeah. a little healthier. A little healthier. Very Absolutely. nice. All right, we're going to get cooking in just a bit. And we are back in the Roadshow Kitchen. You can hear the sizzle. That, uh, those are from the, uh, that's from the fish tacos that we are making this morning. The Breachway Grill is, uh, is the restaurant today. Oh, Craig is here with us, and you have, uh, you've got the fish in the pan. We well, got a little spice on there. Yes, a little, little obey. Mm -hmm. just, a, just a little hint of that to keep it going. Right. Turn the fish over. We'll season both sides. Okay. And then. Obey is one of those things. You can use it for everything. It's pretty universal. Yep. Put a little of our Narragansett beer in there to. Steam the steam the fish a little bit, give a little bit more flavor. Absolutely. Can't go wrong with that. Any of the beer is good. It's like that, bacon. Bacon yep. and beer. Right. All works. All works together. So how long? This is a this is a very flaky fish. Folks use this for uh, for fish tacos a lot. How long should it cook without being being too much? Um, you just as, when you see the trans loosen go away, mm -hmm. it's pretty much done. Got it. You know, it, and it'll start to break up, so right. you'll see it. And um, you want it to break up on the taco, because that, that way you don't have a big piece of fish. So right. we'll, we'll actually break it up as we go along before we put it onto the onto the taco shell itself. And it's pretty much, uh, now it's even f somewhat falling apart in, this, in yes. this pan as well. Yep. Right. Absolutely. It's a very delicate fish, as you mentioned. So it's it's very easy to cook. Yep. No, you have to no fear. You can't you can't overcook it. We'll we'll take it off well before that. Now I've even heard that even if you aren't a seafood lover, and you know you know the story, um, this is great. This is this is kind of an easy way to be introduced to it, it or absolutely. even give it a try. It's, and a, don't even it's a mild fish. Right. There's no fishy taste to it. And then when you add our other ingredients, you know you have all that that, that fresh bold flavor. So it really is a it's a w easy way to eat fish. Easy way to eat fish. Eater. So some of the other things you have here, you have obviously have some avocados on the on the plate that we're ready we're going to put uh, put that together mm. and some other really i mean this here is delicious that's mango salsa that yeah. we make and pico de gallo we offer usually with the choice of pico or mango mm -hmm. and we also have would you like both so right. we do some some a lot of our clients like to actually have both of them we have our flamingo slaw which we made by accident years ago when we had a power failure and we had all this cabbage that we had to do something with so we marinated it in red wine and jalapenos and it became a nice little zesty topping for our fish tacos i love that i love that okay so we will uh, we'll let this uh cook away for uh, for a little bit we'll come back we'll put this together and then we'll also talk about the uh, the breachway grill too because the warm weather is here and you're going to want to head down and get some uh, some great seafood and other delicious uh, delicious entrees as well. Back to you. In the Roadshow Kitchen, owner Craig Marr is here from the Breachway Grill. Fish mm -hmm. tacos is what we're making today. Yes. Also brought a great cake that we've, we've all been eyeing for for a little while uh, here too. And we'll give that a try as well. So thanks for being here and tell us what, you, what you've what you been doing. Well, we put a little of the fresh Atlantic cod in the pan. Mm -hmm. We seasoned it with some Old Bay. Mm -hmm. We cooked it through. Uh, we put some uh, Narragansett fresh catch beer in there to give it a little bit of a steam effect. Right. Yeah, so get those flavors we got going. The fish. We put our, our corn tortillas over here, get them warmed up, and we'll, and we'll, we'll start an assembly process. Okay. Which is, it sounds so simple, it, just warming up those tortillas, but it definitely very, makes them more pliable it when It does, you wrap it and in. it brings out the, the corn flavor, too. Mm -hmm. sure. So then we put a little of our white cabbage on the bottom to start. Yum. So what you do? Just shred? Just, it's shred just shredded it. white cabbage, exactly. And we put a little of that on there. You're right, though. It does look a little different than it typical. It does, yeah. looks great, though. Put some fresh avocado on there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we will add our fish. This is something, too, a lot of people, you come home from work, you don't feel like, you know, cooking a big de a meal. This yes. really is uh, is easy. It's very easy. It's it, simple it's, to make. It's very simple to make. Filling, but not super heavy. Exactly. Right. And, um... And we will top that. Oops, sorry. That, right. that will. This is our flamingo saw, which gives it just a beautiful color. That looks delicious. Yeah, it does. It looks, makes that color pop. 
And then we're going to use today both of our pico de gallo mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and some mango salsa that we've made. Yum. So and obviously we were talking about tacos, big weekend for big tacos. Big weekend Cinco for tacos. What are you guys doing? We are, we are actually uh, doing a lot. It mm -hmm. is our seventh anniversary. Oh, we opened on May 5th in 2011. Mm -hmm. It's Cinco de Mayo, our anniversary in the Kentucky, Kentucky Derby. Derby. <laughs> so we're having hot browns, we're having burritos, we're having margaritas, we're having mint juleps. Hey. Party place. We have a live band coming in at 7 o'clock, so it's going to be a big party happening down there. I'd say so. Down well, cool. Yeah, and where are, where are you? We're on uh, Charlestown Beach Road, on the corner of Charlestown Beach Road and Matuna Schoolhouse. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. So right down the road from the Breachway. Right. Yeah. There go the name. A right. beautiful menu there that shows it off well. Shows it off well. This is our Kool-Aid that we make in-house. It's sour cream, cilantro, and a little jalapeno. Okay. Not too mm -hmm. Spicy, but we just put a little of that on top. You know, it's nice to get that little kick, though, when you have the sweetness of the mango and yep. the tomatoes in there. And we garnish it, and then in the restaurant, we'll serve it with a side of rice and black beans. Right. So Yum. it becomes, you know, a little filling. But you actually get three, but we mm -hmm. wanted to do two today just to just to show it. And look at the color. I mean, it's so vibrant. It, it is. And summer. you can it's smell. Like it's like yeah, it's mm -hmm. summer. So if there were smell of vision, they would be able to smell <laughs> it. But it, it, it really like brings it. all those nice smells out. The old bay kind of brings it together, and it's really a it's a light, fresh dish, mm -hmm. and right. it really. Uh, it's one of our most popular dishes on the menu. And right, seven now years in business. Yeah, yeah, look at that cake. Here, yeah, well, I know you were eyeing that. So tell us about this one. I just want a little, little bite of this. Oh, uh, we'll get it you looks, for it. It looks great. Tell us about this one, Craig. Because this, this is a popular seller. This is, the uh, this is made by my uh, assistant chef, Zach, who you saw on the screen earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, his uh, step-grandmother makes this for us every day. Uh, she comes in and makes it in the kitchen, and uh, it's as fresh mm. and as moist. I mean, I don't think you've ever had a cake that moist. Before. Oh my God! I can't tell you what's in it, but there's one ingredient that we will give away—a little Malibu mm. rum to give it a little Ooh. bit of that. You know what? Now that you, you can you can take. You can taste That's it. all she told me, and only okay. because she she asked me to buy her a bottle of Malibu rum so she could well, have it. Yeah. She won't she won't give me any of the other ingredients. Maybe she's not putting it in the cake. <laughs> she also makes a delicious uh, Kahlua chocolate cake. Uh, for really? Us. Yeah, it's. I mean, hey, that's just nice. Really, really that's delicious. Good. Your menu really, that's really runs good. the gamut, though. I was noticing uh, uh, pizzas and soups it, and and some. It really some does. Great I mean, we have a, we have everything from fresh seafood, obviously, because mm -hmm. we're you know right, right down the road from Point Judith, but we have uh, steaks. Our pizza is probably the best in Rhode Island, and yeah. until Memorial Day, we'll be able to get a half price every Monday. That's, that's great. Dine in or carry hey, that's out. That's nice. We're still doing our special Tuesday night dinner for two and a bottle of wine for fifty dollars. That's oh, each get a salad, each get an entree, for each 50 get bucks? a dessert like coconut cake and a bottle of wine. Yes, that's it's a, a great it's deal. A great deal. Oh, what what is, night is that? That's Tuesday night. That's Tuesdays. Okay. Get down. Mark get down your calendar. Yeah, Tuesday. Tuesday. Every I will Tuesday night. Be there. We will stop all these great specials come Memorial uh, Memorial Day weekend because yeah. we, the season really is in full swing. Well, then, we yeah. just can't do that. But just a few Tuesdays left until then. Get, so get, get there jump now. on it and hey, jump on our website for this recipe.